Yeah. Know who it is when you see that chain swing. Big woods lit while I lane change. Boys hating on us, but they lames. I'm about getting money. I'm on the same thing. What is up, YouTube gods and goddesses out there in the world? It's your boy Mike from Duckwalk Professional, and we're out here for another day living the dream. And I just wanted to ask your guys' opinion on how you like that new intro. Um, I tried something a little bit different, trying my skills out, trying to learn something new. So uh, let me know what you guys think and let me know how the boy can get a little bit better. You! Did he put new brush on and go from that routine? Or see if the hub is back? I'm not sure. That's what I'm saying. One pub, the other pub is different from the color. The color is very different. And maybe she's different. Yeah, that could be the other thing. They might have grabbed the other ones off of something else. <laughs> what? What happened? What do you mean, what happened? What happened to them? They got dreamed on. They were? Yeah, they were dreamed on. How? That's not what. Oh, you're going to kick me in my balls. <laughs> So what are you doing there? Are you doing yoga? Practicing. You try the hub. You try two new brushes and call it a day. Either way, the brushes are going to use, so it doesn't really make any difference. Why is a bloody dog? Or later. I don't know. It all depends on how guys you aggravate me. Yep. Okay, the project we got going on right now, I'll show you guys. We're doing a little bit of cleanup. Um, we got a fire pit on the deck, and it was starting to show a little bit of rust spots. And uh, my mom was like, oh, okay, I don't like that. Can you do something about it? So it's up to the boys to take care of the problem, show you what we're working with. Okay, this is the Rust-Oleum we're going to use, and I matched it up pretty much to that color. And uh, before you start painting, the important uh, thing is to spend enough time in the prep work cleaning the rust off so you get a good finish and you don't have to go back and do it again. So basically we just use some um, plumber's abrasive sand cloth to clean that up. I wouldn't generally recommend that, but um, that's what we had here. Saving a trip to go get some more from the hardware store. Uh, I'll just use that and clean it up real quick. I do things. Shake that bitch up and have some fun. Fall in love doesn't seem so bad, but I always want the girls that I could never have because I'm hanging now, trying to have me swimming pool. As I watch the water drain, I just hope it's skatable. A dollar bill, I got no plans for the weekend So don't you let me down, don't let me down in the deep end So that's what the baby looks like after one coat. Uh, you want to make sure you spray lightly and that's probably my biggest um, problem with doing spray paint is I spray a little bit too much and you get a little bit of them clumps but I'm happy with that. Uh, spray lightly because you can always go over it but you can't take shit off once you put it on there. Alright, I figured I already had the paint and the safety stuff out. I might as well take advantage of the time waiting for that baby to dry in between uh, coats to make a little art. So we'll see what I come up with. Pool scum and a broken cigarette. Russell sniffing cocaine and dug it soaking wet. Go big and you get what you pay for. Maybe I'm a loser, but at least I got my skateboard. Hey, man.
like whatever you guys are uncertain about in your future and your life, you can't let that down. Run who you, like run who you are and who you want to become. You have to know that deep down inside of you, within you, there's a certainty that can't be stopped. You just have to know that it's going to pan out because you're doing the best that you can. And like we're all just here doing the best that we can.